What's up, guys? How's it going? How's it going? Good. How are you? Oh, you got to be loud today. Find out who's got a voice. Have you seen any separation now that we're towards the end of spring camp with your quarterbacks? You know, and, uh, we're trying to separate the reps more than anything. Uh, trying to give them equal reps with the ones and twos. You know, um, they both they've all done a nice job rising up with the chances they've had with the ones. So I'm excited about the way they're competing. Would you like to see one guy separate himself at this point or no? You know, I think it's too early to tell. It's gonna be too hard. Not in the first, you know, a dozen practices. It's gonna be too hard to truly separate yourself with what we're doing. They're just gotta keep raising the bar, and, and that's what they're doing a nice job of. Justin had an impressive freshman year. What do you want to improve on? What's your goals with these 15 practices to get him to play better for the ball? Just to learn the system. You know, just to learn the system. I can't go out. Last year he did a nice job. I love some of the stuff I saw on film, but I don't know what they're asking him to do. You know, um, all I know is what we've had in our dozen practices, and he's done a nice job with it. Uh, I mean, there's some footwork things we're working on, you know, to hone up the position. I think that position is really critical. It's probably the most strict position there is when it comes to fundamentals. And footwork, we really believe in. Um, so fundamentally, I think he just being a true freshman from last year, there's a ton of that stuff we're really sharpening. So that, I'm excited about it. He's done a nice job. Doug Bretter said a few minutes ago that a lot of the a lot of the old linemen were taken in that first round of the roster draft for spring game. Is that sort of a we value the offensive linemen a lot? Is that sort of a, a, a telling point of how they performed this spring? No, I think it was more our, our general manager system we had in the draft room on our team. I think building it from the inside. I think you know, we'll see on Thursday, right? I mean, who are you going to take first? How are you going to build your team? Uh, I think you got to build it from the inside out. Those big guys in the trenches. Nothing. Nothing can go back. Nothing in the backfield can happen unless you got a guys up front. So I think we, as a GM for one of the guys, in the, me and uh, Coach Hayward on Coach Hayward's team, we kind of built it from the, the front end. So what does that? What have you seen the growth of this offensive line unit show you? They're doing a nice job being physical. Real nice job being physical. Uh, a good job at doing what we're asking them to do in the run game. And uh, and Royce is running hard behind them. Our backs are doing a nice job in protection. They're doing a nice job, and that's leading to the play action stuff, which we believe in. You know. Saturday, you were up in the booth. Is that going to be a typical spot for you come fall? You know, I don't know the answer to that yet. I know I was told to go up there on Saturday, and so I went out. Good run. A lot of stairs. <laughs> good, good. All right, let's go.